Hello YouTube! Back when solar generators first hit the open market, you were lucky if you could find a simple unit that supported 1000 watts and took in maybe 200 watts of solar power and the units had no pass-through generation at that time. It is a new era and the o Alps <laughs> provides enough to power a small home, take care of scary power outages, and provide you enough power to live close to an ordinary life whenever the power goes down. This Mega 2 from Alps provides 2,500 watts of backup power with a peak power rating of 5,400 watts. This particular unit can be charged using a standard wall outlet, and it charges super fast using up to 1600 watts to fill up the battery as quickly as possible, which equals more convenience for you. When it comes to solar, it has an Anderson cable input connector, and fortunately, there is an MC4 to Anderson cable converted excuse me, converter included in the package. You can input up to 2,100 watts of maximum solar input, which is plenty of solar to keep you powered all day and all night long. This unit will power everything from your television and your modem for streaming services to outdoor equipment, for instance, like my electric powered lawnmower, leaf blower, and any electric tool that you can think of. This ranges everything from miter saws to drills, and it will charge all of the batteries that you need to build off the grid. The rated battery capacity is 2,048 watt hours with a rated voltage of 51.2 volts, and it is a Life PO4 style battery. The working temperatures are between 0 and 40 degrees Celsius, or 32 degrees to 104 degrees Fahrenheit. It, the unit weighs in at 48.5 pounds. The Alps or Alpes Mega 2 has a very simple to read LCD screen, which includes the battery capacity percentage, fault warning, remaining discharge time display, AC output, USB A, USB C, low temperature protection, cooling fan indicator, high temperature protection indicator, battery capacity circle, Wi Fi and Bluetooth connection output power display, input power display, DC 5521 port status, as well as the car charge port status. This unit uses up to 1600 watts while charging from an AC input. This is where you really want to be careful because if you have other large loads on the same plug or on the same outlet, the electricity load is going to make it so it could be enough to pop the breaker. Fortunately, this unit has the option of using a slow charge function, which will take the 1600 watt input down to about half at about 800 watts. While I have not had any issues, if your electrical hasn't been updated in a long time, this might be a really good idea for you to use just to be on the safe side. You don't want to pop your breakers. <laughs> It's very expensive to repair. When it comes to solar charging, you can hook, hook up as many as six standard solar panels connected together to the device, which can charge it from zero or on empty to full in as little as an hour and a half. There is also a car charging option using the car charger off of your car. This unit is entirely new to the market and it is just now becoming available. There will be expandable battery packs, which are going to be available, that you can connect to the main unit. As usual, you can definitely check out the link down in the description box, box below to find out more about these external battery packs. Thank you. 
Alps also has an app available which allows you to control your power supply online. Unfortunately, personally, I am unable to download apps and I get an error every single time I try any app. But if this is your cup of tea, the app will allow you to log in and use your Bluetooth devices in order to match the frequency signal and successfully match it up with Wi-Fi capabilities. Once you're able to do this, you will be able to turn items on or off at your convenience, whether you are at home or at your campsite or not. You will also be able to verify how much power you have coming in and how much power you have going out at any given time. For all of you techies out there, this power supply will definitely not disappoint you. All right, everybody. In conclusion, let's compare this unit to others. It is much, much more affordable than comparable units at just $1,359 at the time that I am making this video. That is only 54 cents per watt, which is half what it used to be. It has a 2,048 watt hour capacity with 2,500 watts of AC pure sine wave inverter power with a 5,400 watt surge. It maxes out at 1,600 watts while charging by AC, while others are usually half that amount. It takes about an hour and a half or less to charge from empty to full by the wall outlet and just a little over half an hour by AC and solar combined. With the accessories via external battery packs, it is expandable up to 10.24 kilowatt hours if you use four of the batteries that are for sale as accessories to this unit. It is a seamless UPS backup option and it has the adjustable recharge that you can change from 1600 to 800 watts. The LifePo 4 battery has 3,500 life cycles up to 80% and it has pass-through generation. This is very important. This means that you can use the unit at the same time that you are charging it. It has 15 outputs for multiple devices, which is going to include four USB-A ports, two USB-C outputs, DC 12 volt output, and an Anderson output for RV DC devices. It also has the smart control and monitor in the app. Many units do not have an app, so that is a lot of convenience in one little power supply. If you have decided if this is the right unit for you, I will leave all links down in the description box below. As for me, this is one of my top three favorite power supplies, and it will be added as my main source of backup power to my personal collection. Do what you can with what you've got. Prepper Princess out.